The next step of the operation is a face and scalp transplant where all the muscles, soft tissues, and skin are removed from the recipient's face. The donor's face, muscles, and soft tissues are then precisely transplanted in their place. By transplanting younger donor tissues, the procedure reduces the probability of tissue rejection and offers potential for aesthetic enhancement, particularly in cases where the donor is significantly younger than the recipient. It also restores functionality and structural integrity to the recipient's face and rejuvenates its appearance. Brainbridge then carefully sutures the skin to conceal the complex rewiring beneath the surface. The skin is then treated with a special spray that contains growth factors, antifibrotics, and antibiotics. This spray promotes faster skin healing, prevents infections, and reduces scarring in the sutured area. Finally, immunosuppressive drugs are administered to prevent the recipient's immune system from rejecting the donor body. After the surgery, the recipient is carefully monitored in an intensive care unit and is kept in a coma for up to four weeks to prevent movement or misalignment of the connected body parts. During this time, the head, neck, and spine are firmly stabilized to optimize the fusion of the spinal cord. Life support systems are utilized to regulate breathing and circulation, while nutrition is delivered through a jejunostomy feeding tube.